Zeus, the supreme god of Greek mythology, is acknowledged for his powerful lightning and thunder, but the god also had made use of divine defensive equipment, that is the Aegis of Zeus. The Aegis is a powerful shield made with skin from the Almathia goat, which was Zeus's wet nurse when the god was just a baby hidden in the island of Crete. After Almathia's death, Zeus handed its skin to Hephaestus, the god of the forges made a powerful shield for his father and coated it with the sacred goat skin. Zeus used the Aegis during the Gigantomachy, the famous clash between gods and titans, but after he had consolidated himself in the supreme throne, the god handed his shield to his favorite daughter, the goddess Athena. The already formidable Aegis became even more powerful in the hands of the goddess of wisdom and war strategy. Medusa's head had been added to the shield. In gratitude to the goddess of wisdom, the hero Perseus, who with her help, had managed to decapitate the dreadful Medusa, fixated the Gorgon's head on the goddess's shield. Now the Aegis was not just a defensive shield. With Medusa's head, Athena could make use of the shield to petrify her enemies if she wanted to. And so the Aegis became one of the goddess's symbols. Athena's shield is so remarkable that today few people know it is actually the Aegis of Zeus. But in ancient times, the sacred Aegis of Zeus was seen as an icon of power and divine authority. In ancient Rome, the Aegis of Zeus and Athena was used as a symbol of power and protection. In the hands of Zeus or Athena, the Aegis is certainly one of the most famous artifacts from Greek mythology.